Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the water supply tube in a GE dishwasher. It's going to be a very easy repair. should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a flat blade screwdriver. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new water supply tube. The water supply tube is installed at the bottom of the upper dish rack, delivering water to the middle spray arm. The main reason why the water supply tube should be replaced is if it cracks, causing low water pressure at the spray arm and, as a result, dirty dishes in the upper dish rack. To get to the part, we need to open the door. Let's pull the upper dish rack and slide it back so we can expose this uh, rail end cap. To remove the rail end cap, you can either open this tab with your finger or use a flat blade screwdriver. I'm going to use a flat blade screwdriver. Uh, pull it up here on the side and uh, slide it off. And now we're going to remove the opposite rail end cap the same way. Now I'm going to slide out the upper dish rack assembly. I'm going to close the door because it's going to be on the way. And place the upper dish rack assembly on the countertop. We need to remove this water supply tube with the spray arm attached to it. For that I'm going to place it on the side. And I'm going to pull on this locking tab. Support this uh, spray arm with your left hand. And now we can remove it. Now we need to disconnect the spray arm from the water supply tube. See those cutouts? Uh, that's where the locking tabs are. Grab this nut and turn it counterclockwise if you look from the, the side of the spray arm. And now we can pull it apart. This is the old water supply tube next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. Right, this is the new water supply tube, and we're going to mount the uh, spray arm on it. We're going to place these tabs here, and then uh, turn the nut clockwise, if you look from the side of the spray arm. So it's locked. Now we can install it onto the uh, dish rack. All right, so we're going to bring in the supply tube in the spray arm the dish rack and we're going to install it. We have here two hooks that goes over the two wires and this central wire is like a, a median. One hook goes below it and one hook goes above it. So then we're going to simply press it in. And the rear, rear lock here just clips on the wire. Now we can install it. Right now, we're going to slide the uh, upper dish rack onto the rails. It goes uh, right between the rollers and the opposite side. I'm going to pull out the rails and we're going to install the end caps. The end cap goes on this way. I'm going to place it on and press it to lock. The same thing on the opposite side. Roll the dish rack in and close the door. Plug the dishwasher in and enjoy your clean dishes. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other videos available on our site, on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram. 